At Boston's Green Fest, automotive hobbyists participated in the One Gallon Challenge, an attempt to construct a vehicle capable of driving 100 miles on just one gallon of gasoline. Jory Squibb spent over 1,000 hours and $2,500 constructing Moonbeam, a micro car that managed 93 miles per gallon at around 55 miles per hour. When I was filling up my Toyota and saw $46 on the gas pump, that was a shock that made me think, there's got to be an easier way to get around town to do my local errands uh, than to have a big car. You know, there must be a way to take parts of a motor scooter and put them together and, and have a, a light, efficient car. And that's, that, that was the birth of Moonbeam. Moonbeam has a 150cc engine and is constructed using parts from two Honda Elite motor scooters. While lacking some of the amenities of a typical car, Moonbeam has three-point seat belts, a welded roll cage, and a stereo system. Also attempting the challenge was Bill Buckholtz in his own creation, the Derigo. Derigo is a diesel-powered contender with a three-cylinder engine making 28 horsepower. Mated to the engine is a five-speed standard transmission oriented for front-wheel drive. So we formed a large group to design this car based around the Automotive X Prize requirements and came up with this. And um, it's a much more car-like vehicle than Moonbeam. It goes down the interstate at 65 miles an hour all day, happy as a clam. Uh, it goes 72 if you really push it flat out. And if you back off a little bit and go in around 50 or so, you get the best mileage, about 90 miles to the gallon. While neither car managed to make 100 miles to the gallon, Derigo ended up with a respectable 88 miles per gallon at the one-gallon challenge. Reporting from Boston, I'm Justin Meisinger. IDG News Service.